Good morning everybody, this is Alexandre of Angel Cartomancy and it's my pleasure really to welcome you today on this new episode. So these video lessons are dedicated to help you gain more confidence and ease and also to discover the secrets of the Lenormand Oracle. You can learn a lot just by watching these videos and I also invite you to subscribe and also to share this video with your friends who are wanting to learn this wonderful system. So today we're going to talk about people in the Le Norman deck. So in a moment we will be going to the table where I'm going to explain um, how you can recognize people in your life through the deck. Okay. Uh, we all know that the card number 28 and 29, which is the man and the woman, are the major personages or the major actors uh, in this deck. But there are also, uh, you know, people who have minor roles and they can bring, you know, some surprise, some blessing or even some trouble. And I'm going to help you recognize them and also get wisdom through their placement in a spread. Okay, so we have a lot of cards on the table and uh, I'm going to explain how uh, you can use them. So this video goes along with uh, another video that I have made, which is episode 5 on this channel, which is fire up your readings with the code card. So this is just, you know, a little bit of uh, additional information. If you have not seen the episode 5, I urge you to stop this video and to go there because it's, you know, a follow up. The two videos work together, but this one has a little bit more uh, detail about the personage uh, in the deck, okay? So for the sake of this video, I'm using, as always, my uh, classic Lenormand, you know, with uh, the trim size. I like to use that. I have big hands, so compared to the uh, actual bridge size. It's a little bit, you know, longer and a little bit larger. But still people who have small hands can actually use this. And this deck here is by Cartamundi in Belgium. And this was my first, uh, not this deck, but uh, this was the first deck that I had where I discovered the normal. And this is actually, you know, another one that I had uh, years after because the first one was too, you know, the quality is not that good and I've shuffled them and the deck had become, you know, very thick. And I prefer to keep it away from my hands and, you know, keep it as a souvenir uh, to, you know, use them and uh, destroy them. So, the main people in our reading are the man and the woman. Very important person. Okay. And in my book, The Art of Little More Reading, I explain that uh, I like to have decks that, you know, the people have uh, faces or have their backs, you know, in, uh, in opposite direction, you know, so they can have, they can be face to face or back to back. And when I'm doing a reading, especially with one tableau, and if it concerns a relationship, if they are face to face, this is very positive. Okay, there will be you know positive answers. That their uh, relationship is harmonious. Contrary to back to back, there is some argument and disorder. So these are the main character. They never change. They represent the man asking the question, the woman asking the question. And in a gay relationship, uh, I don't like, you know, these uh, deck with multiple men and women, even if people like to, to use them. I prefer to stick the traditional, you know, 36 card. And if it's a woman asking the question, you know, she will be the woman and the man will be her partner, even if it's a female person. You know, and same here, if a man asks a question, he will be the man and his uh, gay partner will be the woman, okay? 
so the work uh, with each other okay so then there is the other person in uh, the text that can symbolize other first person let's have a look at the family relationship in the deck so we start with the mother and the father fear so mother and father there is the house and there is the stork here again the faces each other or the back each other okay so the stork will be the mother figure and the house will be the father figure okay so now if uh, this is the upper generation we will say these these are the mother the father same line as the men as the woman let's do it like you know or genealogic uh, tree okay so these are these can be you know, the, the man or the woman can be uh, a mother or a father so same line okay now younger than them will be the child okay it can be a son it can be a daughter but you know this is someone who is the newest generation okay the newest generation so from the line of the querent there is the uh, previous generation which are the grandparents and here we found the lilies and we found the bouquet the, they are both flowers so they are couple and as you know the lilies are the cards of elderly person so this is the father this is the grandparent okay now if you have an uncle or an aunt which will be uh, between your your generation and the generation of your grandparent aunt and uncle will be the fish the king of spades uh, diamond sorry and the crossroad the queen of diamond so these will be uncle these will be aunts okay so in the same generation again here with mother father there is brother and sister and brother and sister would be you know the heart okay the scythe or the jack of tanyaman will be a cousin male female and they will be, you know, on the same uh, line as the ankle and ant, a little bit down. So here we are, we have the grandparents at the top, the lilies and the bouquet. Then we have their, uh, if you can say their uh, children who are your ankle and your aunt. And this person has children as well, and these are your cousins, and they will be the, the scythe, okay? We are not looking here at the card property, okay? So uh, some people will say, oh, this, if it is the scythe, this will be a cousin that always like to cut ends, you know? If it's an uncle here with the fish, he is someone who is rich. No, we don't look at the property of the Lenormand energy here. We concentrate on the people card, the playing card inserts. Don't uh, mix everything, okay? So then there is you and your parents, mother, father, you know, you brothers and sisters and then there is the child okay so this is the genealogy tree of the Lenormand deck okay and uh, it is very useful because sometimes when you do a card tableau let's, let's pull down uh, an example let's take this deck because this one is already mixed so Let's see. Okay, there we go. Just to have, you know, an overview of the uh,
Okay, so this, this is just for demonstration. We have not set any question, just to give you an overview. So, if your question was about your ankle, okay, so here, let's say, there is the first three cards, and we have the fish, we have uh, the whip, and we have the man, okay? So, your reading starts here with the three cards. The first card uh, says that there is fish, which is abundance, and there is an argument about this abundance and you are implicated in this situation. And you may want to know the source, okay? There is the king of diamonds who is an ankle, okay? So your ankle may be arguing with you. Not with money, but your ankle may be, have arguments with you, okay? So here, let's say that you are a woman here, and you see that your aunt, the queen of diamonds, the crossroad, has a secret with the book. Okay, so let's say you have a question for your father, that implies your father, and we have the house here at the very end, and he is between, you know, the scythe and the, um, the snake. So telling me that your father is facing a cousin who is, you know, a false person who is uh, manipulative, okay? So this is how you can actually, you know, see things. For instance, for your sister, the heart, you know, there is your grandmother who is coming to visit with the writer. Hope you can see that. Okay, so this is how you can actually get, um, you know, more dimension to your tableau and really, you know, you don't need to, let's say that you are asking a question for the whole family, okay, let's say there is an event for the family, that there is a wedding, so of course you will look at the, the garden, which is a group of people, okay, and it's really down there, and near it there is the stork and there is the heart and there is the bouquet. Bouquet is grandmother, heart is sister or brother, and uh, the stroke here is the mother. So you will get, uh, you know, an umbrella of, uh, of uh, signification, okay? So here there is the mother coming for a visit, the grandmother is coming from abroad with the grandfather here, the lilies, to assist the wedding here with the ring, you know, so this is how you can play, you know, with all these person's cards in your reading and get, you know, a lot, 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 lot of information. This is why I love Le Normand because it gives, you know, layers and layers and dimension and dimension for the reading. It is not something that is, you know, fixed here. You pull the cards, they say, uh, fish is money. Uh, whip is argument and there is the male and it stays there. This can turn into, you know, an uncle arguing with you. It can turn into, you know, uh, other people in your life that, you know, um, are uh, influencing some sort of decision or event, okay? So for instance, you want to know who is the troublemaker, you look for the clouds and the clouds is just there. And you look at the person's card that is the closest to it. So it can be the grandfather, the card just, you know, uh, there, there is the lilies, the grandfather, or it can be the cousin, or it can be both a grandfather and a cousin who is bringing confusion and difficulties uh, in this situation. So have you seen Lenormand is a very, very interesting system when you know where to look for information, okay? And these videos are really dedicated to help you gain more confidence and also I will unveil more and more secrets for this amazing oracle that I have been working for with, sorry, for more than 23 years now and I'm always amazed by the details and information that they can bring up. So now I invite you to subscribe to the channel, to place a comment in the box down below and also to share this video on awesomeness with your friends, with people who are interested 
with the Lenormo uh, reading system. And I look forward to talk to you in the next episode. Bye.